I mean, it's just nothing but a hot, yeah. you know, it's it, like like a hair dryer. Yeah, it's pretty much like a giant hair dryer blowing in your face. So and it and you know, air conditioning really can't keep up that much, especially late in the day, and it takes so long to cool down. We did hit 104 yesterday, the new record and the hottest we've been since way back uh, August, uh, almost two years ago, August 2020, and it's going to be just about as hot today. There's our morning clouds hanging around here, 77. Uh, same thing, Converse, Stinson, 72, Bernie Stage, 75 in Lotus, and. And we do have our humidity. Humidity did drop somewhat yesterday, but with that 104, we had those heat index readings uh, about two, three, four degrees even above that. Right now, as far as any heat index, add a couple of notches to these temperatures. Feels like 79 there at the airport, 80 in New Braunfels as of right now, and 82 in Castorville. We do have just a low amount of mold showing up from yesterday's pollen count and throughout the rest of today. About the same scenario, 90 at noon, 102 high temperature. That's one away from the record today, obviously 103. And then those gusty southerly winds, 10, 20 miles per hour. And once again, we do have a heat advisory. Does not include all of the area, pretty much along 281 west of there. It does include San Antonio and New Braunfels. We are going to be seeing heat index readings well up about 105 and 110 and higher than that, especially over to the west by the Rio Grande Valley. Triple digit temperatures continue. Is there any end in sight? Details coming up in just a couple of moments. Steph, Mark.